Praise the Lord. <laughs> uh, Father, we just simply ask that. Thank you. Just may the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart would be acceptable in your sight. Thank you, Jesus. You are my strength. God, you are my strength. You are my redeemer. In Jesus' name we pray and I bless you. Let all the Lord's people say amen. Thank God. Now you can clap your hands while you're taking your seat. Amen. Praise God. Praise God. Praise God. Thank God for the fresh outpouring. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Glory to God. Thank God. Thank God for Jesus Christ. Amen. In heaven above. Thank you, Jesus. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. Amen. Now, I am really am glad to be here in the house of the Lord. Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. I, I, I feel so childlike this morning. Amen. Um, I'm in the, uh, gosh, um, when we was in school, we, um, I think they still doing it today. I don't know. We had roll call. Amen. <laughs> you, they call your name and you say present or just wave your hand or just say here. Glory to God. My God, here. And that's where I feel this morning. Bless the Lord, even though our God, uh, my God, my God. God, oh God, I heal the spirit of God in the praises. Amen. My God, that's special. I feel mighty special when the presence of God is here and the spirit of God call your name. And so here I'll be walking. I say, here, Lord. Glory to God. <laughs> That'll bless you if you think about it. Amen. Never mind about going over somebody's head. I'm saying when the presence of God here, that's special. When the Spirit of God call your name, my God, could I help but say, yeah, I didn't yell it out, but in my, in my spirit, and he heard me. Present here, Lord, I'm here. Because <laughs> he is here. <laughs> Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Mm, so I praise him for his fresh outpouring. Amen. That's that's that. You just never know what what he's going to. I thank God for Jesus for this entire week. Amen. Somebody bless him. Hallelujah. With a, just just a pl oh, numerous, numerous. Had some beautiful moments this week. Uh, fellowship. Amen. I'm not to my work. Work is work. You know, uh, I, my place of work going on, shut down, amen, and my hours coming together. But I'm talking about just some meaningful things. Uh, thank you, Lord God. Uh, uh, just meeting uh, those in the body of Christ. And there's fellowship when you come together with those in the body of Christ. Amen. Praise God. And so I, 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 I walk with expectation on a, on a daily basis and the expectation is, is, is in this wise to just uh, is that to know the times that we live in. You're going to be in the right place. Amen, somebody. I, <laughs> in, walking in the right place at the right time. Amen. Um, uh, continuing in the uh, uh, walking in the Lord, his, the principles, those principles have become discipline and you know and nothing is done in yourself and when it all of a sudden it appear before your eyes and you find out that that is purpose where you are and the things that you're saying and the thing am i is anybody hearing me today glory to god the things that you're doing amen and i just bless god and just the people that that oh god at a meeting amen I, I i just praise him so when we walk in the light as is he in the light? Amen. We have what? <laughs> Fellowship one with the other and the blood of Jesus cleanses us from the all. Oh, come on. Thank him for the blood. Hallelujah. So I just bless God. I bless God. Uh, I, I just thank him. I just thank him. I really wanted to um, share about, uh, oh my God, just a, a lot of caregiving things today. I really wanted, it was, uh, and I kind of built up the momentum to uh, 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 do such, amen, um, um, uh, based on is just what, what I've observed and what is occurring, glory to God, there are a lot of shepherds that are feeding themselves, 
Amen. And not caring, should not they care for the people of God, should not they care for the sheep. Amen. That that's really what I was building up, up Milton. But God really touched my heart. Amen. And so I want to let you to know, let you know today that our God is with us and near us. Amen. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Could you say that with me? My God uh, is with me and he's near me. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. He's, uh, I've got, uh, and so it's just, uh, uh, if we can just stay, we, it, just simple scriptures, simple scriptures, nothing uh, complex about them. Amen. Uh, uh, but they certainly are trustworthy. They, they prove that God is certainly who he is. And I, I hope, <coughs> I hope, and I trust that. Uh, in hearing the word of the Lord today that that you just write where you said you you hear his word but it'll bring something back to your remembrance on what he has done has 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 our Jesus has he done anything for you have he done a half a thing for you come on let me see your hand I said a half a thing because <laughs> I know he did more than a half Glory to God. <laughs> I thank him. I thank him. I thank him. Uh, so uh, my prayers and hopefully that, that, I mean, think about it. Oh, my God. Say it again. My God is with me and he's near me. Amen. That's enough to, to, to go on from there. Praise the Lord. So just, just these uh, uh, passages here. Glory to God. I thank him. Um, not God is a, he's a sovereign God amen um, um, he's uh, omnipresence and that 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 is just saying he's everywhere what at the at the same time praise God he's um, um, omnipotent amen and that's just simply saying he's all all powerful glory to God Praise the Lord. And I know it's one more. <laughs> Praise God. Omniscient. Mm -hmm. Omniscient. And that's saying he's what? All. All knowing. He knows about you. He knows about me. Amen. Knows about every, everybody. Praise God. So, so just those, those uh, there's not really highlighters, but it, they really kind of accent and punctuate that our God is with us. He's with me. Now, I want you to take it personal. And that's what I actually to say it. My, my God is with me and um, he's, he's near me. And there's not that much difference between um, because he's God. Jesus is still on the throne. Amen. Um, right in. Uh, it's a place of honor, people of God. Amen. It awaited him. Glory to God. Um, um, uh, but uh, been, been declaring that. Uh, for the past few weeks, but he's seated there, not only making intercession for our prayers, but expecting. Say, so our God is in expectation. Thank you, Jesus. He's in expecting all of, of, of the enemies be made his footstool. And who do you think has the enviable task of assuring that? Amen. Somebody say me. Amen. Amen. You are. God is going to use an earthen vessel. So, so you can see the scope. Amen. My God is with me. He's with me and he's near me. Is that uh, these are just proof producing passages that, that you are the one who are occupying until Jesus come. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. You are. You are the one that's proving uh, in the earth realm. Uh, that the curse has been broken. Amen. Glory to God. Oh, what's that? Oh, the snare is broken and I have escaped. I'm waiting for the rest of the words. <laughs> My help is in the name of the Lord. Lord, the snare, come on, say that with me. The snare is broken and I have escaped. My help is in the name of the Lord. The snare is broken and I have escaped. My help is in the name of the Lord. Okay, now sing it during the week, okay? 
Praise God. It, it's, 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 it, especially when something happened, when you've been bought out again. Amen. Traps are set. Amen. But God, but the Holy Ghost will spring them every time. Glory to God. Amen, somebody. I don't know what this testimony um, um, now, 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 uh, Pastor Hinton has gone to be, be with Jesus a long time now. I, it, it's uh, about two decades now, but I never forgot his testimony when we were in Atlanta. Amen. And, and, and that's why it's good to pray for uh, those who facilitate the gospel of Jesus Christ. Amen. And the people of God are just tired and he driving back to um, Atlanta, to Chicago from Atlanta. And he just tired. And um, anybody dr driven and you, 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 your eyes just automatically close. And uh, 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 you can't account for the time when you owe. And then when you open it, oh, my God. And, and then your heart go, what? Because you know. That, that. I thank God for Jesus seated at the right hand throne of God. The, the spirit is willing, the flesh is weak. Amen. And um, so uh, just giving generalizations. And he said, oh, my God, and I'm just driving. Oh, God, have been gone for a uh, two, two week meeting and and he just driving. My wife knew the testimony. I said it to him many times. He just driving tired and just all of a sudden he just um, 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 by the time uh, almost a few miles from 94. Now that's Chicago in it. 55. No, 55. And then he connected to 94 and he just tired and all of a sudden they go this white horse caught up with the car and he say he Looking like that, oh my God, am I dreaming? <laughs> Y'all ain't going with me on this one, isn't it? <laughs> Praise God. Come on, God. You know how to, you tired, you think your mind is what? Playing tricks. Is this illusion? And he said, the horse just right up to the window and he wanting to stop. And well, he got that opportunity after a while uh, because um, as he kept driving, you know, you driving, but looking out the side of your eye. And, and he said, after a while, the whole stat, white stallion just groom, groom, went to the left. And he said, now's my time. And he pulled over, got out the car, but the horse was gone. Come on, say, the horse was gone. Praise God. And so, leaning on the car like that, uh, 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 instead of going back to open the door like that, he turned around this way. Somebody turned around this way. God will have you to turn the other way to see something. <laughs> oh, God. And so when he turned around, the bridge, oh, that was there, but now destroyed, was there, was no more. And it wasn't but death because the car could have fell down. Uh, oh, my God. You know, like a, a, in a, 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 a ramp just break, let's say, the city in near bridge. If it's gone, it's nothing but water. <laughs> Glory to God. And he walked near it and said, oh, my God. God did a miracle. Yeah. Praise God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Now, in your right mind, if you knew that, you would have made travel plans to detour. But what happens when you don't know it? Come on, come on. What happens when you don't know it? Have you been in a situation where you didn't know? I'm talking about because you're held accountable for that which you know. But have you ever been in a situation where you didn't know? Hallelujah. And God proved to you uh, that he's with you. <laughs> And he's near you, somebody ought to shout uh, in this place. So that testimony, that blessed me. That's impossible for a car to ride on the air when a bridge out. So when you go through Chicago again, you go, uh, just look. <laughs> look at them ramps and bridges, praise God, on 55 and 90. They're always doing construction in Chicago. <laughs> Or you get to the Wisconsin border and things like that. And think about that testimony. Our God is an awesome God. So he was, so say it again, my God is with me. And he's near me. Uh, not that much difference. Amen. All right. Near me. He's by my. Amen. Who with me because wherever I go, he is. Okay. We got that now. 
Now, isn't that simple? Isn't that simple? That's very simple. Near me because he's by my side with me. Because wherever I go, he's with me. Amen. Glory to God. But you have to say it with your mouth. Something in earth realm going to be proven. And so, uh, uh, once again, but the curse has been broken. Amen. And it has. The finished work in Calvary has already been done. Amen. Death is defeated. Amen. Glory to God. It's been defeated. Death, hell, and the power of the grave has already been broke. We have our relationship with Jesus Christ. And we can have some clean living here on this earth. Oh, I wish I'm so excited today. Glory to God. Amen. I said we got some clean, holy living. Amen. Oh, glory to God. I wish I, I, I want to challenge somebody. You write down to how much God has blessed you. Uh, I'm talking about just on this week. It ain't even happened yet. Amen. Oh, my God. He's doing, he's manifesting his presence. Praise God. But, but the curse has been broken. We have that opportunity. Amen. To receive restoration from everything that the palmer worm and the canker worm and the caterpillar have eaten up. Hallelujah. Somebody say, I lost some things. I lost my reputation, but I got it back. Glory to God. Lost some finances, huh? but God, God restored me. You ought to shout back that God restored my finances. Oh, my God. I was homeless, but now I can sleep in my own bed. Didn't have a father. I'm to my natural father. Because there are many don't even know who their own father is. Don't know where he at. You here, so you had to have a daddy. What's that? Because it takes two to tango. I knew you'd be quiet on that. <laughs> Some don't know their own father. Mother dumped them, but that, that, they don't know. Him. But God is our heavenly father. <laughs> He'll be a mother for you. You don't have to go by. So curse. So yes, yes. You, you just confirm. You said that. Amen. The curse has been broken. The finished work on. And because Jesus is in me and near me. Amen. We have the opportunity to turn some things around. Amen, somebody. Now that's good living there. I look forward to it. Amen. You hear the politicians, I look forward to clearing my name. It's still dirt. You're still dirty. Okay, what you do, that, that's for, that has an illicit motive. But oh, what can make me, oh, who can make me whole again? <laughs> Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Amen. Though my sins be a scarlet, he makes them what? White. Amen. It's no, I mean, ab 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 aborted. Everything is aborted. I'm talking to you. Praise God. You got to, I want you to be excited about everyday living. You have an opportunity. Amen. So we have the opportunity to turn all of that around. Your reputation is turning around. Amen. Glory to God. For my God is with me. And he is near me. Come on, shout. Come on, I want you to believe that. I told you, it's just plain and simple. Now, this first scripture, everybody knows Psalm 23, so turn it there. Or, um, I mean, it's four scriptures. I, I don't think I'll get all of them. Um, I feel like just I'm just going to talk today. Glory to God. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Turn to Psalm 23. My God is what? With me. And he is what? Near me, near, near me, because he's right by my side. Glory to God. With me, no weather, wherever I go. Didn't David say it if I make my bed in hell? What, God, you're there. Revelation said, and the sea will give up. They what? They're dead. Man can't find them, but God knows where uh, those resurrect. Oh, because they have to resurrect. Amen. Now, now, look at this simple psalm. 
this um not the, the entire but look at this look at the fourth verse yeah, Amen. let's read it together all right one two th- you all probably you already know it all right one two three go yay though i Okay, hold it right there. All right, say that over again. One, two, three, go. I walk. Uh huh. Amen for the word. And now, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Amen. Even though I'm walking in the uh, uh, in an area where it appears like I'm going to die and I'm going to be eaten up. Amen. Now, this is uh, 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 this was uh, last during the winter season, um, because in the winter season, you know, not much activity. Amen. A lot of activity in the, in the realm of the spirit. But it's the time God preparing us for going into the fast and the consecration because after the fast and the contrary, then new life began. And right during that time, we were in a period in our church, amen, where, where, where I was led by the Spirit of God in the teaching in the winter season to take us to a different plateau. Amen. Uh, because uh, uh, and ascending, ascending means what? Going what? Up. Up, up and away. Not away yet. Not so fast. Praise God. <laughs> Not time yet. We was going in ascending, taking us to a place in him. Because anytime you go to a place, there are higher heights and then there are what? Deeper depths. Glory to God. We was going to a place and, and, and every shepherd, a good shepherd, amen, um, during a certain time of the season, they take them to higher levels. Praise the Lord. Amen. Before the, 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 because up, up there, amen, because in, on the flatlands, glory to God, uh, the vegetation and the grazing, amen, um, I, you know, because of the change of the season. But on those higher plateaus, amen, there's green grass up there. Amen. Under the boulders. Come on, somebody. Under the rocks. Huh? Got that. Those there are things in the earth that are hidden. Uh, my God. Uh, but because the spirit of Christ is in you. Yeah, he'll lead and guide you. And that, that's what's so joyful about it. There are things in the earth that are hidden, but you shall find him when you seek him. Oh, I wish you could shout with, with everything that is in you. you and when you seek him, you're going to find it. You're going to find him when you do it with your whole heart. Answers to dilemmas. Answers to problems. Glory to God. There's even money in the earth. Now, we done testified about that, bless God, during them lean days when I couldn't afford Similac. What's the others? Infamil and they still sell all that. Similac and okay, see that show you. I'm back from that now. That's way back yonder, <laughs> but it still costs. <laughs> it still costs, and there are times I just didn't have it. Amen. Uh, went for a walk. Glory to God. Turned down Wilson Avenue. You know. Uh, oh my God. Oh my God. Begin to skip a little bit, and there it was. It tur- It came up. Oh my God. Now you know somebody probably dropped it. I don't know. But I just happened to be in the right place at the right time. That 20 came in handy. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Now, see, I don't know what's happening in your life, but everything in my life is ordered by the Lord. And I find out, God, thank you, because you in this. It don't matter, because as you increase in godliness, it's going to get more difficult. So higher plateaus, you're growing, I, you're growing in Jesus Christ. You, I'm looking at you, you are growing, and I know everybody not here. Amen. Thank God and for us today. Thank God. Now I could have said, what fifth Sunday off day? Oh, but let me get off of that. Amen. I praise God because I'm happy in Christ. Plateaus, you're growing in grace. 
You're growing in the knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. You're ready to be trusted. Amen. You're ready to be trusted by the Holy Ghost. There's some changes that are happening. Glory to God. That's what ascending order of higher plateaus. Amen. The grazing. It was new grazing and God knew where it was and the shepherd was leading them. But it's also, and before you got there, there were wolves there, coyotes there, uh, mountain lions, high, high up. There were predators who were waiting for the sheep. Amen. So that's why, that's why the scripture said, though, um, um, in the what? In the, yea, though I walk in the, in the valley of the what? Shadow of death. Amen. Because they could get killed. The sheep could get killed. Amen. Bless the Lord. Oh, my God. But that rod, God, your rod, because you're near me and you're with me, your rod and your staff, they comfort me. Amen. Bless God. Uh, see, what do you think the rod is there for? Glory to God. Because if a predator come, glory to God. Isn't that something? Amen. They could take that rod and beat his head. Come on, somebody. Amen. I knock his feet under it. You place putting on the full arm of God for a reason. But it's not the flesh and blood. It's against principalities. Come on, somebody. Rulers of the darkness of this world. But you're not blind. You can see. Hallelujah. Spiritual wickedness in high place. So that's what that rod, the rod is there for. You just, just club them. Woo, and then they'll go. Woo, woo, woo. That's how the enemy is supposed to do. Woo, 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 with his tail tucked. You got power in you. I'm just, dis I'm, 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 I'm just a little intolerant about God's people being defeated in life situations. Can I just be honest? I'm just, just a little intolerant. Amen. It's victory. Victory. I don't care how I look. Come on. It's victory. Now, how you can tell by the expressions on your face? Amen. That's victory. And I'm not talking about put on a facade. Glory to God. Bless the Lord. But something ought to move you. Something ought to stir your confidence in God. Hallelujah. My God, he did it once. He can do it again. So that's what the rod is for. Now the staff, amen, it got that little hook on it. In the right, uh, that little hook you know, you could Nah, can't just see them little arms. They falling off the cliff. <laughs> and they go to that ship. Because you're going to plateaus. Okay? All right? Ascending. And then that's descending. Now, 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 you should have stayed on the road in the first place. You should have been following the sheep. My sheep know my. Okay? We got that. Like the rapper say, do you feel me? I ain't going there. <laughs> oh, bless God. So he about to slip. He get the staff with the hook and grab and pull him to safety. Come on, thank God. Come on, thank him. Come on, praise him. Hallelujah, because he's with me and, 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 and he's near me. Amen. There isn't any excuse where you shouldn't have a victorious day. Oh, did I say something wrong? It, uh, did I? I it, it, no excuse. You, you not having a victorious day. Amen. It don't matter what it is. Something didn't add up. Amen. There's another day. Amen. Glory to God. So that's, that, that's what I want to, 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 to not pound to want it to sear in your consciousness you are descendants of the most high God because he did because Jesus did now I can do all things through Christ which strengthens me amen 
Glory to God. You got to get an opportunity, young mothers, to pray for your sick child. Because they catch things. You know what right? Amen. Uh, children don't know how to fight spiritual warfare, but you do. You're going to get an opportunity. Oh, mama, come on. Imagine when bronchitis has and pneumonia and the lungs. Because I'm saying this because it happened to me. What I mean, it club, I mean, uh, plugged up in the front, plugged up in the back uh, with the money all out. It, the woman of the well, she used all of her money for physicians uh, because every time you go, you got to give her what? A copay, my God. And the balance hasn't been reduced. Uh, it can come a time. Uh, where you going to stop and say, God, I need your help. My God, your help is not only on the way, but he's on the inside of you. Oh, come by the shout. Bless God. He's near me and he's with me. So you're going to get that opportunity. You will get an opportunity. You're going to have several opportunities. Praise the Lord. Not worrying about the danger zone called the shepherd. Amen. His rod and his staff going to comfort you. Every snare going to be broken when you go forth in confidence. Trust in God. You can't be indignant and prideful now. You got to be honest with God. I remember when I was honest, I said, God, I'm poor. That's not the nature of God. But it hurted me to say that because I, I said, God, <laughs> when you lose, and, oh, I don't even want to go. But I, that was honest. Just like when I had pain. I said, God, I'm hurting. Amen. Now, that's a prayer. Praise God. Is that's what it's taking to stir up your faith? Because if he did it on once, he'll do it. Again, but we're going to higher plateaus now. Praise the Lord. Amen. There are deeper depths, higher heights, and they interchange. You're growing in grace. You're growing in the knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Amen. Then after the depths, there's the heights. After you've been there, you got to glean the experience. Amen. Don't ever forget what the Lord has done for you. What that song we sing? Jesus, I never forget. Oh, Jesus, I never forget. How you know that old song? Oh, Jesus. Mm hmm. Me, I'm. Jesus, I never. No. Never. Amen. Now, do you have a testimony to go with the lyrics? <laughs> That's it. Hebrew 13. How y'all doing, you two? Glory to God. Having a ball in the house. Glory to God. If you just tune in, you tune in at the right time. Hallelujah. You heard the right word. Our God is with you. <laughs> and he's near you. Near you because he's, he's right by your side. Amen. Ooh, with you, no matter where you're going. He's there with you. Christ in you, the hope of glory. Okay, amen. Glory to God. I just want to have fun with that. Amen. Amen. All right, Hebrews 13. Come on, say it with me. My God is... Amen. You're the one gonna, that's gonna, gonna will validate such Hebrew 13 okay um, one of my favorite passages amen fifth verse the fourth ain't bad either now <laughs> amen amen but the, the, the context of what we're sharing today look at the fifth verse let your conversation be without what covetousness amen um, um, so so don't let the things you say all the time be uh, uh, always 
talk about now covetousness. And this is the spin I'm going to take on cov- covetousness means to desiring, uh, 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 lusting after things, desiring things that others have that you don't have. Did I say that okay, wife? Okay, that's just generic. So don't let your conversation be always, oh God, I wish I was in their place. Oh God, God, I wish I had this. And I, 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 as if uh, 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 the Holy Ghost is bankrupt or something. Uh, he's unlimited. God, I, whoo, one day. We always say in one day. Amen. The, the, the Spirit of God is the only one that, that can bring your future into your now. That didn't get nowhere. Glory to God. That didn't get nowhere. Then the only one that can grab your future and bring it into your now. So that's why you can say what you say now. And shout when the visible manifestation occur. Lost you again. Oh my God. Oh my God. But so don't let your conversation be always warning and always uh, 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 and, 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 and I, 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 I can remember we can remember Gator. God I'm tired of riding hoop D's that's the tailpipe it is <laughs> amen we always have flat tires didn't, didn't it come on somebody. always having flat tires I even got a bicycle one time. And now you know that's a trial, amen, when the cars, I mean, two, they in the yard can't move. The body looks gorgeous, but they can't move. And so I bought a $10. I paid $10. That was a lot of money back then. It was. Bought it from an old fisherman. Had the, bo- had the basket in the front. Mind the old Wizard of Oz. Y'all remember that late on Wizard of Oz? <laughs> it was one of them bikes with the basket. Come on, I want you to graphically see this. Amen. I mean, it was red. <laughs> so I'm, I, but I didn't sit. I stood up. <sighs> now that's Brother Hardy there. <laughs> Got home the first day. The tire, tire. I said, "Hey, wife!" Boom! The tire blew up for no reason. Now that let you. That's a trial. It wasn't no nailing. It just blew up. Okay, so back, now we're back to walking again. Amen. God, I can't. Every time, and, and hear the words. God, every time one thing happened, if it ain't one thing, it's a, okay, see? Wanting, desiring, illicitly, uh, uh, because you desiring. Why can't I be like others? Why can't others understand what I'm going through? And God is developing. He's developing you. The next level of your development, I remember when the Spirit of God spoke that to me, is in the area of faith. Hallelujah. And your exercises, your life circumstances. Oh, when we ever grasp the facts that all of that can be turned around, by the word of God, speaking, that, I mean, the word of God. Oh, my God. And you believe God without a shadow, and, and you just holding fast. Amen. It will turn around. See, now, now, now I can fast forward. Every last one of those situations has been turned around. Let me tell you something. It feels good to go in any restaurant you want to go. Amen. Amen. Now, can we make a boast in Christ? Amen, because first of all, none of that don't mean nothing. Uh, I, none of that mean nothing. But when something turned around, now, uh, my son, I had, a, uh, I had to go to, to L.A. And so uh, he was at Tennessee. You remember? I, I said, look, I don't want to go by myself. I got an interview. Uh, it was the financing stuff, you know, uh, with the visionary stuff. Didn't know you have to follow these things, amen. And 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 God, oh God knew all the way which way it was going to turn up, amen. But you know, by fact, you just on the journey. So I told him, son, okay, I say I'll buy your ticket, amen. Okay, yeah, dad, I got a connection in Cincinnati, so I routed it. We met each other in Cincinnati, amen. And then went to L.A., amen. Hallelujah, bless the Lord. Now my son is different. So we, we was in there, and they said, Dad, the first day, now nah, I know you interview tomorrow at nine, but let's go 
let, 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 uh, uh, we're going to, yeah, I know, the perfect restaurant to go. We're going to Morton Steakhouse. Now, that sounds like a common name. But when I walked through that door, first of all, the valets took your car. I said, oh, my God, what am I getting into? <laughs> my God. And the first time I went in there, I saw Jim Rome. Y'all know who Jim Rome is. He meant sports personality and this. I mean, it was a place of place. Amen. Folks coming out there with the Ab- How do you do, sir? And, uh, now, these are the cuts of steaks. The steaks were raw. <laughs> the rib out here, the porterhouse here. They were interviewing you on this, what they going to cook for you. And I said, oh, my God. <laughs> they bought out a whole potatoes that long. My God, just telling you all about it. Look, we are good. <laughs> the bill was, I ain't going to tell you. But we handled it. We can handle it. Now, that's what I mean. That's good living there. Because I remember. Hallelujah. Now, to me, that was turning it around. Now, do I make a habit of going to eat Morton's on the weekends? No. I go to Longhorns. That's good living. That's good living. Don't y'all be afraid of the places you go. Because it's turning some things around. You already disciplined. Because can't you see how that can lead to pride? But I won't eat unless I go to Morton's. I won't eat unless I go to Peter Luger. Oh, that was something. Wasn't it? Oh, my God. So if you ever desire, don't you, you'll get your opportunity because it's turning it around. Yes, Even for a Mississippi boy. Yes, Amen. Yes, They'll take ch- chicken gizzards and make it look like something. Oh, come on, somebody. <laughs> Glory to God. Now, I, I got the clothes. And now, I am just, just want to talk the common because you're going to have opportunities to turn it around. Now, this, is a, yeah, this scripture here is a boast in the Lord. And it's okay to make your boast in the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory to God. And never because I am not under subjection, uh, under the curse, uh, in the lineage of men in my life. I'm the first to preach. Uh, and let me tell you something. I'm going to let the devil know it. Uh, I'm going to preach uh, until Jesus come, uh, until the heavens ring. I'm the first. Hallelujah. Didn't Jesus say, I am the first, uh, my God, and the last? I'm talking about in the lineage of men in my life. They didn't care about God. My father accepted Jesus in his later years. See, that's making you boast in the Lord. Amen. All my children have accepted Jesus. Hallelujah. So those are just things you can boast in the Lord. So whenever you get low in strength, amen, look back what God has done. Amen. Now, and so now I can read the scripture and we're going to stop. Amen. Um, 13. If I, so don't let your conversations be, amen, um, covered in this. Always uh, uh, doubt for disputation. Oh, God, I can't wait till I get to this place. Oh, God, he's got, I mean, I, you, you have to be developed. Amen. And then that you have to be trusted to handle much. There are many who have come in and gone out. Amen. Glory to God. Glory to God on things. Amen. But they are crumble. Amen. But your, your foundation in Christ is sure. And it's set. Amen. So that's what don't let your conversation be um, uh, covetousness. And be content. Come on. I want everybody to say this. Um, be content uh, with such things that you have. Come on. Let's declare it. I will be satisfied with what I have. This, this may be that I don't want to live here, but I'm going to be satisfied. I'm talking to someone. Amen. I may not dress the best, but I'm going to be satisfied. Do y'all hear me? I'm going to be content where I am. 
Amen. But it doesn't end there. It doesn't end there. Glory to God. My God is with me. Okay, when you do those things, thank you, Jesus. For, and this is why I say be content with where you are. For he said, I'll never leave you. How do I know? Because my God is with me and he's near me. Near me because he's where? By on my side, amen, with me no matter where I go, amen, he's with me, he, 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 Christ in me, wherever I go, I bring Jesus with me, praise the Lord, to the backslider, my God, my God, and you with, oh, Mr. Hampson on a Friday night, turn out the lights, and light a candle. Mm -hmm. When you in that place, you know Jesus is there with you? Come on, think about it. You made the profession. Now you're making an error to take your Jesus where the light's going to be turned low and going to disobey his word. Okay? Amen? Glory to God. Glory to God. All that turning around. Women of God got power to say no. Amen, Amen somebody. Amen. Tell them boldly, you ain't getting none of this. Amen. Now, should I be more specific, wife? <laughs> You know, because we can go, uh, okay, I, uh, no, 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 because I'm a daddy. I care about daughters. Don't you let no young man use his lips to explore your body. Amen. Because he'll do it if you let him. Now, should I tell how he going to do it? Okay, all right, all right. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go back then. I'm going to finish. That we, so be content. You're growing in grace in the knowledge of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. You're, you're, you're anchored. You're anchored. You know, your God is with you and he's near you. That, and so when you do all this, for he said, I'll never leave you or forsake you. Amen. That's what God says. That he'll never leave you or forsake you. Now, this is what you're going to say. That you're going to say this. That boldly, God, you're my helper. And I won't have to be afraid no more. Come on, stand on your feet. Uh. Glory to God. Glory to God.